week because I got a lot of editing to get done. Um, today I don't have any appointments per se, but I just had a little segment release on like a Facebook news source yesterday telling everybody that I was doing videos. So I've gotten like tons of inquiries, so who knows what today holds. All right, today's goal is to turn the office into, into this. Okay, now I'm gonna rewind and go back into actually some of the parts of me redoing stuff and then we'll jump back to here. So what I did yesterday was basically tore apart my entire office, got really stressed out because everything was so disorganized and all over the place, um, and then brought it all back together and now I'm nice and happy with it. So let me take you around real quick. Starting with the desk, this is a Husky 52 inch work table. It is adjustable height. So it goes up and down. Um, I upgraded to the Audio Engine um, two wireless speakers, but I wired them because I don't want any lag coming from my computer. Um, and then everything else here, I kept it the same on the back side of this. I have four um, Philips Hue um, lights that are 3M mounted to the back of my monitor just to give me some really good backlight. With those Philips Hue lights, one, they're aesthetically pleasing, it looks good, but two, it actually really helps when you're color grading to have backlight and, and white backlight, so that way your eyes see better color contrast. Um, I don't know how to explain that, I don't know the science behind it, but it works. And then there's this guy. So this is a Husky 62 inch work table. We stay in the top. Um, it's got a nice pegboard here. And these guys, you can put all sorts of goodies, like I put all these attachments that you can have for stands and um, bottoms of camera. I've got some um, heads down here. These are what I use when I vlog. I've got like four of these and I attach them to whatever I need to change the camera out onto. I've got my hourglass, super important. Not. Um, okay, but the cool stuff. All right, this top drawer is my charging drawer. So I've got all of my big Sony F-style batteries. I've got my double AAA batteries here, my B-mount battery, um, some extra camera attachments, and then I've got some charged batteries over here. Next drawer, we've got some nice cord organization. Nothing, nothing. And then we've got some ND filters and lens caps, um, some flashes and audio equipment. This drawer, I've got all my extra camera attachments. This drawer, I got some extra tools and these are life savers right here. These are um, Velcro um, cord straps. So I use these for cord management, all my hard drives in here. Uh, these are all just 2020 so far. And one junk drawer. You gotta have one. So, so far, very happy with the way everything came out. Um, it's definitely gonna allow me room to reorganize this room however I want to because everything's on wheels. So. Um, long story short, my business is growing and I uh, got some clients who want to do a podcast. So 
instead of renting a studio for a thousand dollars, which is like the cheapest I could find around here, I'm gonna have my own. I'll probably be looking at a tighter angle like this. Um, so that way we've got all the black wall and the background. You won't be able to see this white wall. Um, I'm gonna mount some lighting here for backlighting and then I'll have my Aperture 120D with the key light here to shine. My, my main subject will sit here and then I'll probably sit here on the switchboard um, and go from there. All right, so long story short, my business is taking off and I make tons of videos for other people but I wanna keep doing these vlogs um, for myself because it's fun, it keeps me creative, and um, the cool thing is is there's, there's no scope of what it needs to look like or what somebody wants it to look like. It's just me and what I'm doing, and I want to be able to look back on these vlogs, um, especially with family, and just kind of see what, where my head was, see what I was going through. Um, I'm a big journaler, and so I'm going to use this as my visual journal because, to be honest, I don't go back and read my journals. Um, that's kind of boring. I would rather watch and be entertained and maybe my son can come back and watch these someday and see what I was up to and see what he was up to and his mom was up to. Um, so yeah. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe, like this video, leave a nice comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next video.